Welcome to Tech Brothers. In this video, we're going to learn how to compare source code in Team Foundation Server 2013. So let's do that. Here is um, my uh, Visual Studio, and I'm connected with my Team Foundation Server, and I have a team uh, uh, team project named Tech Brothers underscore Team, and I have three branches in that: Dev branch, Main branch, and Production branch. Now, in why do we need to compare the code? Sometimes what happens is that uh, you put your um, uh, project into source control, such as TFS, and then uh, you go ahead and edit that and make some changes on your local repository. And you wanted to know that whether uh, the project in um, whether the the um, project or source code in Team Foundation Server is different than my local repository. And if you're not sure, then you can compare and how different it is, you can compare that way. And also, if you, uh, the other scenario is that uh, you wanted to compare the code between your main branch or your production branch and your dev branch to see that how much the code has changed and what changes have been made. And in this, in these scenarios, uh, the compare code is really a handy tool. So what I did just for this uh, demo purposes, I have a project in main branch. Uh, I'm going to compare this project with a project in dev branch. Now it is the same project, but I have made some changes in dev and I wanted to see that what changes that I have made in dev branch uh, before I go ahead and merge the changes from dev, dev, dev branch to main branch. I would like to see that. So what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and compare um, with the main branch. So we're going to right click on that and click on compare. So here is the source. Source is in dev branch and the uh, by default it gets to your uh, local repository. Um, main thing is usually when the compare comparison happens um, it's the first uh, scenario that we discussed that uh, in local repository you you have made the changes and we wanted to know that how different it is uh, that is in your source control which is TFS you wanted to do that but you can go ahead and compare between the the branches and that is between the server uh, code so this is a server path if we'll, it'll tell you that this up here the dev branch is your source and what would be your destination and uh, after comparing, if you think that uh, this is okay for me to merge, you can use the same tool actually to uh, sync the changes. Whatever the changes is in dev branch will reflect in main branch. But uh, right now, we're just gonna compare and see what changes are there. So uh, up here is our main target. So we're gonna open up and this is our project. We're gonna go ahead and click okay. And uh, you have few options right here. Um, if you wanted to compare, uh, latest version or change set or any of that right here is the option that you will need to select I'm going to use it uh, the latest version up here and latest version in the target and um, show item that exists only in source these are the view options that what you wanted to do if you wanted to filter local paths only then you can do that as well so let's go ahead and click OK on that in order to see that um, what has changed and as you can see right now, what's different if this is okay and right here, if you click on the little red, it shows that it's different and let's see that how, how different it is. So we're gonna go ahead and double click that. And here is our source and here's our destination. As you can see right here, that I have put just a little comment on this code and that that comment does not exist on the right side on our target. So this is how you compare. You can go ahead and uh, basically, um, you know, sync these changes right here if you would like to. Uh, but uh, this, this is the view that uh, how you compare the changes in between the branches. Also, you can select the branch in your source control code and your local repository and actually uh, take a visual look on your uh, uh, differences on your uh, particular code. And I hope this video helps.